Hello, guitar fanatics. Boy, you sure are fanatical with your guitars, aren't you? So am I. I ordered off of Amazon this special piece of equipment. This is going to help with my guitar playing skills and ability. Uh, I'm going to read here. It says, to Amazon, from PDT Limited, ASL. I N okay description rock jam style guitar super kit black Canada quantity one so what I'm expecting when I open this box is a super rocket electric black rock guitar and they said it even comes with the little amplifier which is a little bit of a treat and so I'm going to use this special tool. It's a wine opener. Use this special tool to open up this box because it's sealed. Like It's like I'm coffering the mummy with Tom Cruise or Brandon Fraser, whoever you like better. Or maybe you like them both. Maybe you're a rock and roll player who really likes the Mummy franchise. You ever think about that? Maybe you think, maybe you don't even know that you're a fan of the series The Mummy and um, you like rock and roll. Because there's all kinds of rock and roll. There's like electro pop, there's like uh, synth metal, there's uh, Ozzy Osbourne, Allison Cooper, and um, you can like rock out like a like a school kid who's learning rock and roll, um, or you can rock out like a age professional Cherry Garcia, Ben and Jerry's. or you could just like rock out like this guy who nobody knows. Nobody knows who this guy is, but he sure could rock. And um, so that's part one. As you can see here, it says rock jam. That's because of the jam that we're about to rock. Okay, let me show you some things. This is, this is an amplifier. No, this is a tuner to tune the strings of your guitar. This is also a tuner. This is a guitar pick. These are things I already have. And this little baby is an amplifier by Epiphone, Chinese company. Rock Jam. Um, this shipped from Brampton, Ontario, Canada, which is like outside of Toronto. Um, but maybe some people in Brampton say we're outside of Quebec, but like, you know, whatever. We're all the same. We're all rock and roll players. So we got this box open, and we're really starting to rock now. The rock is like flowing through our veins, and um, so I expect a full-blown rock and roll guitar with a full-blown rock and roll amplifier and it's just going to be like wicked awesome that you're good at stuff and you spent money on things that help you and so i put that box over there because it's a rock box and so what do we even do, like, do we open it upside down or not upside down? I'm going to open it upside down because I'm a rock god and I play rock guitar. So here, we have here the rock and roll amplifier that lets you shred tunes at a thousand beats per minute. And that's for me, my crafty ways. And I also got this uh, 
gig bag. Seems like some pretty sturdy nylon, but it's not padded. But it's okay because I don't really care. Um, and I got myself a manual, and no one reads the manual. Um, they said when I use computers, they say real men don't use the manual. I took that to heart. This looks like a pretty decent, I, I mean like the only way I can prove it to you is if you had it yourself, but it's a pretty decent strap. And we've got here a whammy bar in here and one of those like L forks for like Ikea stuff and a patch cable. So now I have at least two or three quarter inch patch cables and one of these kind of patch cables um, to plug in the rock. Well, let's rock this out. If we're, if we're really going to rock here... Oh, wait. Do we have, oh, my. We got a set of strings. I don't know if those are extra strings or I'm going to have to just impose my will upon the strings. Upon the rock and roll. Get started kit. Oh, yeah. So it's like wicked. And you're, you're cool. And I always appreciate when they throw in a couple picks. They probably cost pennies to make. Um, so why not just give me a few picks? Um, I mean, I'm taking picks of their guitar. Their rocking good time guitar. I don't know where I put my sharp instrument. Here it is. Okay. So, um... We're gonna rock open this amplifier. Now really, this really rocks around the clock. It's a Friday night, Saturday night, every night we're rocking. You, you know, a Tuesday afternoon. Someone would say, why are you playing rock and roll on a Tuesday afternoon? I say, I'm just good at rock. It's a rock jam guitar. Yeah, and so this looks to be a, a sizably s smaller than what I'm accustomed to amp. Not to say it's a bad amp, I bet this baby can weigh all like a fish. Fish is another rock and roll band, I have no opinion either way of them. Um, maybe just, oh yeah! Warning, this bag is not a toy. Keep this bag away from babies and children. Do not use in cribs. Why would you put this bag in cribs, beds, carriage, and playpins? The, th the thin film may cling to the nose and mouth and prevent breathing. Danger of suffocation. Who is actually that dumb? I mean, I've been having some self-esteem issues about myself being dumb, so I'm sorry if you're dumb out there or you identify as a dumb person. But, yeah, sorry. But I think that's kind of dumb if you give that to a baby. There's your little amplifier right there. Do with that what you will. I mean, I'm not going to pass judgment if you want to... Uh, amplify your electric guitar and here's where the real beauty is um, I mean I assume it's beautiful it's like this is like a wedding day like I haven't seen the bride yet I don't know if she's she's been in a veil I haven't seen her it's an arranged marriage my father and my mother talk to her father and her mother. Okay, good. The strings are already on the guitar. We just need to tune this and crank it up like it's 1964. I don't know why it was 64. I don't know what how. I think there was probably Beatles or something. Um, 
And we got a little like silica gel pack that they put in with the guitar. And look at this, this is a rocking good guitar. Yeah man. Yeah, this this is like rocking. Um, and just to make a comparison to it, this is rock jam. Just to this isn't a children's toy, this is serious rock business. And so, um, to make a comparison, let me show you this other rocking guitar that I already rock with. I rock pretty hard with this other guitar. This is my friend's guitar. No offense to Rock Jam, but my friend's guitar is probably better. I mean, it's, it's, it's just cooler. It's been around longer. Older things are better. It's just... One day the Rock Jam will be cooler than something else, but... For today, this is the cooler one. Um, so how do I even turn this baby on? Um, so I gotta keep it away from babies. So here we go. Why would they make any of this difficult? I'm a baby. Okay. Du -du. Okay, stop messing with me. Okay, complaint number one about Rock Jam Guitar. They're very clever and crafty with the twist tie. Um, there we go. Now things will be easier. Okay, yeah, clever twist tie. Why would you even, I'm just getting the scissors, you know, like why would you even make it so difficult? I want everything to be easy and working right away. Um, okay. There we go. And now that is done. So you know, this is a little, little thing here, I think we can, we can plug it into this multi-bar, just dust and cat hair on it. There we go. Now we're rocking. So it has power. Do, do. Whoa. Okay. We're kind of balancing a few stones at the same time. So, where's our bag? Starting to have a schizophrenic episode. Do, 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 do. Is this it? Spit out my gum. I've had a rocking cool bag with all these parts. Here's my strings. Where's my patch kit? Here it is. Okay. Go like that. And so this would go in here, and I don't know if you screw it in or something, but yeah, it looks like you screw it in. That's your whammy bar. That's a whammy bar. And I call this an L key. Um,
not so fancy with that one, are we, Mr. Fancy Pants? Okay, so that we've got our patch cable. And what we do is we, it, only so far the power goes, obviously meant to be played from at home. Plug that into there, and then plug, put this down, plug this into here. And so it's not, not turned on yet. So what happens when we turn this on? Okay. What is our problem here? Well, the amplifier may not be working. Let's turn this off. Unplug this and move the amplifier over up onto these crackers. Okay, the amplifier is there. And move this. We unplug the laptop and plug in the amplifier. Not turning on. Turn the knobs. Okay, so apparently the amplifier does not work. Okay, so That is okay. I'm not going to complain. I got $50 off. Plug this on. So much to do. some wonder wall with 
my existing guitar. what it sounds like with a guitar that I know and trust and this is using the patch cable that came with the thing. Oh boy! So we will put my good friend or brother or baby guitar. It's actually my friend's guitar. But I've been keeping care of it for him. So, so we're back in business. Pick this guy up. Off the bat, he seems a little bit lighter than the guitar I had. Just a moment to go. We are going to sit down with this and take the strap out of its bag. Made in the USA, it says. It's good. I support our troops. No, I, not really. Well, I mean, depends who I'm talking to. <laughs> Sorry. No, I like people. Just p please love me. Love me. Okay, no. Okay. So yeah, this seems like a kind of cheapo strap. But it's at least like full length that I'm used to. And like, whew, it really does look like the same model of guitar, if it's not the same parts or whatever. And almost definitely it's not going to be in tune, seeing how they have to keep the strings loose in the box. So we turn on our tuner, it's such a guitar, put it up there. And we let's and we got some extra strings too, so you know what this stinky little amp wasn't gonna turn out to be anything really anyways. Um, I mean I, I guess it could be cool if it was like a nice quiet amp that I could rock out and not disturb my parents. I bet a lot of parents buy this for their like sixteen year old son. That is the impression I get. So, it's kind of sensitive on the tuning. So far I'm optimistic about the sound I'm going to get out of this.
sounds good. Yeah, that noise you hear right now is in the basement. Okay, so we will plug this in. Volume, set down as low as we can. Just set all the knobs down. Um, Sounds fine, sounds perfect. So let's do Wonderwall with this new guitar. cheap strings and I assume the replacement strings are cheap too um, okay so I just bear with me I want to plug this into a different amp. Yeah, so why do I care if the amp is working when I already have a perfectly good, two perfectly good amps? Is the question. I plug in now. So, power is here. And the Epiphone amp is off, and now we plug in the PV amp. Oh, get ready for something. PV amp is plugged in. PV amp is turned on. Volume. So let's do Wonderwall with the PV amp. Good. I love you, Rock Jam. Thank you for the guitar.